I think I'm going to get on a bus, head to Magic Kingdom, maybe hang around there a little bit, and then check out some of the monorail hotels. So I came instead to Grand Floridian, and from here I can go to Magic Kingdom. Now this is some beautiful music. I've stayed here before. A really nice top notch hotel. So the second floor lounge is no more. Apparently they are reimagining it. So I don't know if they have a lounge here right now. But the band that usually plays on that balcony is set up right over here. Isn't this a great elevator? It's an open cage. It only goes up one floor. And if you prefer not to take the elevator, you can take this grand staircase Even the ceiling is beautiful. Look at that. And there are a lot of great places to eat here and the Magic Kingdom fireworks are spectacular from the Grand Floridian. Pushing the light doesn't work. You have to push the button. Keep that in mind. <laughs> Time to head to Magic Kingdom. For some reason we got up to the monorail and they said it wasn't operating we ought to take the bus and that is really not convenient because the bus takes a long long way it takes you to um i don't know i guess we take the bus depot we could go back to the transportation and ticket center and take the express monorail but if the monorails are down i don't suppose that one would be working either but there is another way the water shuttle boats can get us across magic kingdom well obviously i wasn't the first person to have this idea and look at all these people lined up and there's one little boat Plan C. There's so big a crowd that they want to dispatch another boat. Probably never get to Magic Kingdom for the fireworks anyway. So I was just talking about how good it is to see the fireworks from here. Let's try it. What did I tell you? Great fireworks show from the Grand Floridian. There's always multiple backup plans when you're at Disney World. So now the big question is, how do I get back to Pop Century from the Grand Floridian? Especially when the monorails are down. Well, I think the best choice is just call an Uber. It's only eight or $10. It'll get me there in a hurry. 
Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, I encourage you to like and share the videos. Leave your comments down below, and if you haven't already, please subscribe and ring that bell icon up above so you know when I post new videos. Thanks for watching. I'm Mark with the Average Me Channel. Home sweet home. At least for another 12 hours or so.